All right, guys, now that we know how to sort data, I want to teach you guys how to sort data in reverse order. So, of course, like before, we can have something like select name and zip from customers, and we can order by zip. And now, by default, what this does is it basically sorts it from low to high. Whether it's alphabetical or numerical, it arranges the zip code, in this case, from low to high. But say we wanted to arrange this alphabetically from Z to A, or numerically from the high numbers to the low numbers. Well, in order to do that, we need to add a special keyword at the end called DESC. -E. Now, this is short, it's the keyword that shorts for descending. By default, everything is sorted ascending. Now, remember, if you can't remember ascending from descending, a lot of people don't. Remember it like a mountain. Whenever you ascend a mountain, you're going from low to high. Whenever you're descending a mountain, you're going from high to low. You're going down the mountain. So descending means high to low. So basically we're saying, okay, sort by the zip code, but go from high to low. And now whenever we do that, as you can see, our data is now sorted by zip code. The highest zip codes first, and it goes all the way all the way to the lowest. And another thing is, whenever we do this alphabetically, for example, if we wanted to sort name descending, instead of A to Z, it would go from Z to A. Now, of course, the first name V T S R. So, of course, this is reverse alphabetical order. Descending is high to low. Now, I want to mention this. You can go ahead and use ASC, which basically means ascending, but a lot of people don't do that. Since MySQL default sorts it as ascending, there's no need to explicitly write ASC. So there you go, that's a little tip. Now, another thing I wanna talk about is, a lot of people are wondering, how can I just extract or extract the highest or lowest value? Well, in order to do this, probably the easiest way is to select let me go ahead and give you guys an example. Select name ID from customers, order by ID, and like I said, say we wanted to get the, I don't know, the highest value of the ID number, the customer with the highest ID number. What we need to do is first, we would need to sort it from highest to lowest. So remember, DESC basically sorts it numerically from the biggest numbers first to the lowest numbers. And then we would just go ahead and hit limit one. So at first we're saying, okay, sort this information by ID number from highest ID number to lowest ID number, but only return one result. So it basically returns the very first result, which would be the highest number. So as we can see, Lucy Bronson has the highest ID number of 96. Now let me just go ahead and show you guys one more example. Say we wanted the, oh crap, I messed up. Can I get my query again? Ah oh, crap, I can't. Say we wanted, I don't know, the person with the lowest name. We would go ahead and select name from customers limit one. Now like I said, Whenever we want the lowest value, there's no explicit need to write ASC because that's the default sorting, ascending low to high. So whenever we would sort by name, and I forgot to put that clause in order by name, and go ahead and hit go, obviously Alexander has the very first name if we were to sort this by dictionary sorting or alphabetical sorting because by default it sorts ascending order. So there you go, there you have it. There is your little tip, shortcuts, and all the information you need whenever it comes to sorting. And in the next tutorials, I'm gonna show you guys how to filter data and basically showing you guys a whole bunch of stuff. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.